and welcome to the Kala Wallet. For this tutorial, we are going to walk you through how to complete your KYC process. As you can see, it's asking us to upload our selfie. That's part of our KYC. We can click here and it will take us to our settings. If we scroll down, we'll see our KYC or your know your customer requirements. So we'll go ahead and push the complete your KYC. In here, we're going to enter in all of our valid data so that we can get KYC verified for our Kala Wallet. Please remember that all the information that you include must be correct and valid. If not, your KYC could potentially be denied. Here, for the date of birth, you'll want to make sure that you enter it exactly as you see above. So your year, dash, your month, dash, and the day. For your address, you'll want to enter your complete and correct address where you stay. we will be uploading a driver's license. Please remember that when you're uploading your images that they have a 3.5 megabyte um, limitation. So there is a size limit. So if for some reason you're struggling with that, you may want to retake a picture of your driver's license and or password, passport to upload. That could be, that could potentially be a problem if it's not letting you in. So I'll go ahead and upload those. I've uploaded the front and back of my identification. You'll see here that we also require a selfie. The selfie is crucial to the KYC process. If you ever need to reset your 2FA, we will hold a Google Hangouts call with you and we will match you on the Hangouts call to your selfie. This way we know that you are the correct one trying to reset the 2FA and trying to enter the account. This gives you just another layer of security inside the Kala Wallet. I'll go ahead and upload that selfie now. Perfect. Then you go ahead and you push Submit KYC. Just like that, your KYC has been submitted. As you can see, it can, be it can take up to five days once you have um, entered your KYC. Normally it doesn't take that long though. We'll go ahead and check it. You can go back to the dashboard. Once your KYC has been approved, you will receive an email to your email address letting you know. Thank you so much for staying with us for this tutorial. 